Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Yakin Wood, otherwise known as the uh, Yakin the Water Ganassi. If you play D&D, that makes sense. If not, it's all good. Um, but we're back here with another Elden Ring video, and I'll be showing you how to get 70,000 souls easy. Uh, first things first, you need to have this area here. Uh, Salid, Salid, I'm not too sure how to pronounce that. I mean, it's pretty close to this. The first area, you just go right, you go, you go, you head east. Um, it's like a, like a really desolate uh, climate. You'll, you'll know when you're there, for sure. Red skies are usually here. Um, and from there, once you enter, you want to uh, head along these roads here. And um, once you follow this road here, you just want to keep heading east and eventually come across Fort Faroth or even Dragonberry Fork. Um, you'll know you're nearby if you have either of these ones or even this one here. Um, but if you go right on this this right path here, you'll come across here. You'll come across the dragon before you even come across uh, that. So I, I just said the same thing a lot in that same as us. Anyway, you'll see this big dragon here, and you'll see like these you know these um, these walls that are just constantly burning, and that's how you know you're in the right place. And you can whack this thing. It'll scream, it'll do whatever, it'll like roar, like it does now. It has a load of health, but if you kill it, you'll get 70,000 souls. Now, I recommend you having a bleed weapon. Because when this will... Okay, there you go. When it bleeds, I've been testing it out, it does a, like a huge amount of damage. It takes a bit. So I'm just going to cut to when I'm about to kill this thing, but like if you have a bleed weapon, even if you don't, nothing's going to come to attack you right here. Like you have that wall there, you, there's, uh, there's dragons, uh, by the way there are dragons here, but they won't attack you here. Just keep racking its leg and you should be fine. So yeah, I'll just cut to when I'm about to kill this thing. Okay, so I think I'm about to proc bleed again, so I'm just going to get ready here. Um, to show that it, it drops 17 souls and all right there it is <laughs> just gonna make sure it's a fading away <laughs> five dragon hearts and boom all right more than 70k souls 74,000 and you huh all right i'd never actually done that before i just heard about that so i just thought i'd make a video on it um and hopefully you found that useful Again, it's right here in this area here so if you don't have this area yet just follow this path you'll see um, little icons on the map that you haven't discovered yet if you need to find a map there'll be a small icon I think they look different once you have the actual map I think it's that but it'll be around this area you just go to where the map is you discover it and you'll see this path follow it along here you will see it there'll be small dragons smaller dragons around here they're fine, they don't even attack you really, as long as you ignore them, just run past them. You'll see this constantly burning wall, it'll be just along here. And, yeah. That's the easy way to get 70,000 souls. And that'd be really useful. So, uh, yeah, if you like what you saw, uh, consider subscribing if you want to, liking the video, commenting, even checking out my uh, my stream, I stream at uh, Twitch, at uh, twitch.tv slash Jack and Wood. And, yeah, thank you for watching.